Hey Blade Ops, today we're reviewing a Smith & Wesson knife. We had it, uh, and then we sold out of it, it was out of stock, and we just got some more in today. So, I took the chance to do a little demo, desktop demo for you. Like I said, Smith & Wesson knife, it is the SW1500 Smith & Wesson made in the USA Auto. Um, as you probably know, most of the Smith & Wesson knives are not made in the USA made in Taiwan and such. Um, this is the only Smith & Wesson that I know of that's an auto that is made in the US. And it's not an auto conversion. 100% made by Smith & Wesson. Quick little review demo of the outside. Push button, recessed, it's pretty much flat. No safety, comes out quick, have the dagger, uh, almost bayonet blade there, false edge. Sharp on that side. On the blade it says Smith & Wesson SWAT. This is the SW1500. Made in the USA, there's a serial number there. Removable pocket clip, tip down. Cannot be changed. It's a super nice thin construction. It does have a hole there at the bottom for a lanyard. The SW1500 runs about $44 with the free shipping, everything included out the door. You have the three inch 440 stainless blade and you're looking about seven inches overall. If you're gonna carry this knife, um, if you can, it makes a nice carry. It's got the deep pocket clip and it, you know, it's thin this way, which I always like for a carry knife. Only 2.6 ounces. The only drawback for me is you know, well, when you're considering an auto, EDC or whatnot, this is, you know, this is a medium duty knife. It's not going to be for heavy duty tasks or whatnot. whatnot. Uh, it worked great in a self-defense situation um, or cutting stuff, but not, if you're going to do any prying or set or stuff like that, it's, it's not going to hold up to that. Uh, highlights for me are super light. Uh, it's thin. I always talk about pocket real estate. Um, if you're clipping it in your pocket this way, it's not taking up a ton of your pocket, which makes makes a difference for me. Uh, another super big highlight is it's USA made and the price. It's gonna be hard to go wrong with that price. So let me know what you think about the SW1500 Smith & Wesson Auto made in the US. Comment down below, check it out, Blade Ops.